Finally, because of the election on November 4th, the dam is broken with regard to the Keystone Pipeline. Hi, I'm Cynthia Lemus with this week's Cattle Call. The House just voted to send a bill approving the Keystone Pipeline to the Senate. Hopefully the Senate will follow suit and before Thanksgiving we hope to see a bill on the President's desk that would approve the Keystone Pipeline. We've been waiting for six years for the jobs, for the energy, uh, and for the robust relationship we have in North America between Canada and the U.S. to make sure we're North American energy independent. It's time for the President to act. I call upon the Senate and the President to approve the Keystone Pipeline, which will produce thousands of jobs energy that this country needs and put North America and the United States on the path to be energy independent. With this week's Cattle Call, I'm Cynthia Lummis.